Eric, that was you that asked Marty St. Louis the question. Are you surprised that they aren't going to actually give Slavkovsky the power that, you know, you would you would think that he would get the power play time and maybe less five on five time. They're saying, no, we want his energy to be for five on five and he'll play power play going forward, but not just yet. Are you surprised at all by this decision? No. Uh, and I, I asked the question because I know a lot of fans were, you know, I think they were looking at the power play lines and saying, well, what's the point of keeping Slavkovsky here if you're not even going to put him in that mm-hmm. type of position and let him see? Look, the Canadians are not looking at Slavkovsky's development and being like, if he doesn't score 10 goals in the first 10 games, there's a problem here. This is not about goals. It's not about assists. It's about playing the right way and creating a certain uh, confidence within the player. And, uh, you know, one of the questions I asked Marty, because I interviewed him before uh, we had that meet the media Mm -hmm. session was, you know, at some point, if this kid needs to go down, how are you going to, how are you going to tell him so that he doesn't take it as like a failure on his Mm -hmm. part? Because um, we saw in the past with Cockney Emmy that when he went down, he was extremely disappointed, right? Like he, yeah, for sure. A, a, you know, so and it's normal, right? Like these guys have big beliefs in themselves that they, they don't want to be in that situation where they're sent down. I don't think Slavkovsky is thinking for any second that he belongs in Laval. Mm-hmm. Um, but I, I think you know the answer was we might want to send him down there for X amount of games so that he could literally learn how to run a power play. Yeah, it's not necessarily going to be performance based or whether or not we think he's drowning a little bit in Montreal. It's because we might want him to work on something specific that we can't necessarily do with him in Montreal. So, again, this thing like it's the beginning of the season. The Canadians have had a plan with this kid from day one. Mm-hmm. You know, I I don't think I, I think you know Marty said today that he earned his way onto the team, mm-hmm. um, and I. I believe, you know, I take him at his word. I think he's being genuine in that. But I also think that the plan was to keep him here. I think the plan was to keep him here from the start. And one of the reasons why I I agree with you 100 percent, by the way, go ahead. One of the biggest reasons I think that was the case is because preseason and and training camp was not going to provide enough runway for them to properly evaluate what the mistakes are that he's making as a trend. And I I asked Marty about this and I said, like, what? how do you coach this kid to make sure he plays free? And I said, well, mm-hmm. I don't want to overcoach him. I want him to play free. That's the whole point. And I said, okay, well, that's kind of like, so like what you mean is like you you don't want the, the best golfer in the group constantly giving you tips while you're on the course. And he said, exactly. He said, I, I'm kind of like gonna... what Craig Ramsey was doing with Slovakia, by the way. Yeah. He said, I, I, I'm down. I'm fine with him making a million mistakes as long as they're not the same ones, but we need time to be able to evaluate what's a one-off. And what's a trend? And I don't think the way exhibition went with eight preseason games, with never being able to ice a roster that looks like an NHL team, yeah, uh, and the way it was all structured with 75 players here, that they could make that full evaluation. I think they knew that before they went into training camp. And the plan was, we're going to start with Slavkovsky here. We're going to really see what he's all about. And once we know what we can coach him on, mm-hmm. that's when we'll start to make decisions about where he's going to be in – two weeks, in three weeks, in four weeks, in five weeks. And the player himself will be able to dictate how that goes, too. So um, it's not out of the question that Slavkovsky will be in Laval this season at some point? Of course not. And it's not out of the question that any of them will be in Laval at some point this season. I, I mean, uh, I don't think Brendan Gallagher is going to end up there, but I'm talking about the kids, obviously. And look, it, this is what the season is all about. It is yeah. about development. And yes, and that's what they mean when they say, you know, we'll always do what's best for the player. Meaning, if they see that the player is not being helped by playing in the National Hockey League at a certain point in time, for what's best for the player at that point, they'll send them to the American Hockey League.